Hey there, how are you doing? This is Kali from TechFans. Yes, as per our recent Redmi Note 11 video, we have installed this .OS version 6.0, and I have been using this as my daily driver for a week. And here are my thoughts. So without dragging it for long, it is. Uh, I just want to confirm that this is same as the previous evaluation x review so here i will mention whatever or whichever is bit different first boot animation it is cool and the dots make the dot os logo Second, the status bar. Unlike other Android 12 long uh, switches, it is more like Android 11. Also, it is square and when you toggle it, it will be round. And the notification bar is partially transparent, which looks good. There is no special feature or customization tab in settings, but it provides most needed features in appropriate sections. Yes, you have the tap tap feature also. In terms of audio, unlike other ROMs, here you have Motorola's own audio EQ app, which works fine. Also, you have the multiple options to crank up the audio experience. In terms of performance, it is same as the last Evaluation X and the score of Geek Punch is confirming the same. There is not much different. Gaming wise as the BGMA is banned, I have installed the Abex Legends. I am able to play in 35 to 40 FPS in high FPS settings with smooth graphics and realistic color. But it sometimes freezes when lot of action happens in a single place. But you can casually play for some time. Battery backup and charging wise, same as previous, getting the screen on time of 7 to 9 hours, charging takes like 1 and a half hour to 2 hours. Security and safety net wise, the safety net is not passing, it is passing the uh, it is not passing the CTS profile match, but the normal UP and payment apps works fine without any issues. So there are no hiccups. It is an encrypted build, so that is there. Camera 2 API is enabled by default, so you can install all good Gcam. Are there any issues that uh, stop installing this build? Well, it is stable and can be used as a daily driver. There are not many issues, but I would require I would require some customization in the status bar to set the column and row count, but I am unable to find it. Also, issues like zoom video are still there. Uh, like every other custom ROM so you can give it a try that's what about this video leave a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to this channel to support and increase this work if you have any queries and concerns feel free to follow and dm me at techfancy's insta page thank you for watching quote moto